What's going on guys? It's Adam here. And right here we got uh, week five of the Green Tea League. Uh, I'm gonna be doing a post commentary for this. As you can see, uh, my next couple videos probably will be. Um, a couple of health issues going on. I'm fine, I'm just feeling a little down under it. Uh, don't quite have the energy yet. I would like to give you guys a live commentary but also. Um, I know there's no team builder preview for this week. Uh, like I said, just don't have what it takes to do it. Um, so I'm just gonna get right into this. Uh, Tony here, uh, Dutch NT. Um, he brought uh, Slowbro, Garchomp, Forgus, Roserade, Blissey, and Doug Trio. And uh, I brought Mega Gardevoir, uh, Needle King, Klefki, uh, Rotom Mo, Dredigan, and uh, Swampert. So looking at it, I was like, okay, he's probably going to lead Doug Trio. Not entirely sure what he's going to do, but I'm pretty confident he is, so I'm going to lead with Rotom. And, you know, that's what happened. Um, yeah, Rotom versus Doug Trio. Uh, I kind of expected him to set up rocks or something. He actually just went for the final gamut. Uh, brought me down quite a bit. Um, it was... I mean, I, I'm happy with that. Uh, I was going for the Hidden Power Ice there. Um... So he brings in uh, his Florgus after that, and I just Volt Switched out, didn't really want to stay in. And I thought about going into Dredigan, but I thought he would go for a Moonblast, so I actually went out into Klefki. Uh, my Dredigon is actually EV to be faster than the Florgus, um, but I wasn't going to risk it, so I just brought in Klefki, and I actually started setting up my spikes. Uh, let me speed this up just a little bit. Um, so he's taking me down for a little bit, uh, recovering with his leftovers. Not much was going on here. Um, he switched out into his Blissey, and um, this is when I was like, okay, I'm gonna go out into Dirt again. I actually thought he would go for a Minimize or something, just be really cheeky and mess with me, but he went for Stealth Rocks. Uh, so I just go for my Choice Band and Super Power. Uh, already on super powerful. Uh, Blissey had no chance. Now I was choice, sadly, so I had to switch out here. Um, he actually goes for the Giga Drain here. And I don't know, maybe he thought I would go out in a Swampert or something. Um, but uh, I just paralyzed him here. Uh, he pretty much recovered himself up fully. Um, put down my third layer spikes. And I could have probably saved Klefki here. But I didn't really need him. Oh, sorry guys. Um, yeah, he gets the crit there. It's like, I don't know. I just decided to let Klefki go down because it turned out to John's job. And it wasn't going to do much against a Garchomp or Rose Raid and a Flowbro. Especially because this was my handicap this week was the Klefki. I only had three moves and the only attack was foul play. So, this is where I did bring in Dragon. Uh, landed the Gunk Shot, thankfully. Uh, took out Florgas, no problem. And then he sends in Rose Raid. Um, I decided, I'm like, you know what, I'm going to stay in. He went for the Giga Drain. Um, I can take that, no problem. And Gunshot will also take out the Rose Raid. So, pretty happy with the work that Dredigan can put in there. Um, sadly, I did miss Gunshot number three, but... Uh, oh, well. Dredigan did his job. Uh, it went down. Um, so I brought in Rotom. And went for the Leaf Storm. Took out Slowbro. I went for Leaf Storm over Thunderbolt just in case switch out into Garchomp. Um, now, Garchomp has the ability to Mega here, and he actually did. I wasn't quite expecting him to go for Mega, but it, it happened, so whatever. Um, I bring Gardevoir, and uh, my Gardevoir was actually made to be faster than Mega Garchomp after Mega, and that's why I carried Protect this week, actually. Um, so, yeah. He had Iron Jab, Iron Head, and Poison Jab. Not really sure why, but I mean, I guess flinches make sense, but um, my voice is going to go ahead and take him down because it's a Garchomp. Um, our trade for this week, we're actually getting rid of Klefki. Uh, we picked up Starmie off of Tony here. So, I don't know. I think Starmie's going to do really good for us. 